guys, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a boarding school Q&A. So I asked you guys over on my Instagram to ask me all the questions that you have about the school, the rules, how much free time you're allowed, all of that stuff, just so you guys are a bit more clear because I've got asked so many questions and I just thought I'd make a huge video explaining everything. I hope you enjoy this video. If you want to get involved in videos like this, then go and follow my Instagram because I do all the polls on there. I let you know when videos are going to be posted, just a little bit more information. Yeah, that's get right on into this video okay let's go right to the bottom of all these questions the first question is do you leave on the weekends so for me personally i don't leave on the weekends because my parents live in dubai so i'm not going to fly to dubai every weekend so i stay in school during the weekends but for example i'm going to france for the weekend to see my parents so sometimes i will be leaving on the weekends but most of the time i stay in school and the house like plan activities and stuff to do so that you're not bored but some people do leave on the weekends if they have a house nearby when are you going to be going back to Dubai so I am going to be going back in October it's like the end of September when I'm filming this video so I go in around a month yeah I wouldn't say that I really miss Dubai that much I feel like I'm a lot more busy here or like I have a lot more stuff to do so yeah I definitely prefer living in Switzerland over to Dubai and I love boarding the first week it's a little bit like of getting used to stuff but now I really really love it and I love like everybody here all the friends I made mean, they're all so nice so I am really really happy that I did choose to come to boarding school School. Can you do a boarding school vlog? Yes, I am going to be filming days in my life, morning routines, all of it. So you guys will definitely be getting content because I am allowed to film in school, which is really, really good. So I'm super happy about that. Is there a strict dress code? Really, there is not a strict dress code. We do have a uniform. So yeah, that's kind of like what the uniform looks like. The only thing from the school that you actually have to wear is the skirt. So you can wear trousers, but most people wear the skirt. And then you have to wear your own polo shirt and you have to wear, you can wear the school polo shirt and jumper, but most people just wear their own polo and a knitted jumper so it is a very chill uniform i really like the uniform it's really really nice i think i honestly prefer it than if i was allowed to wear my own clothes because it's just so simple and easy and we are also allowed all jewelry i just don't really put it all on because for sports i need to take it off so there's not really much point but yes you are allowed to wear jewelry in school <laughs> how was the food at school honestly it's been pretty good so far breakfast is definitely my favorite meal the breakfast if you don't want the school food one night, you are allowed to make your own food because there is a little kitchen. So sometimes I've been doing that, but most of the time the food is pretty good. And I like most of it, which is really good. And I'm super happy about that. Can you leave the school campus to go to shops and stuff? So every single day you are allowed out after school until six o'clock. So you're allowed around two hours out. So yeah, you can go to like the supermarket if you need some food or anything or a cafe. But then on Wednesdays and the weekends, you are allowed longer out so you can go out for dinner. How many years are you? staying so i think i have three years so i have this year and then two years after this yeah three years at the school how have you found boarding i really love it i feel like you have a lot of freedom at this school so you can kind of do your own thing but then you can also be with your friends and you can kind of like choose and it's really nice like having your friends around all the time i really like it but you still also get your own space which i think is really nice and it's like a good balance do you get a lot of homework in school i feel like i haven't got too much but you do get homework and you have prep time three times a week i think so that's like when you have to be at the desk like doing your work which is good because it like forces you to get your work done almost but yeah i've been able to get all my homework done pretty easily like in the time and everything what is your workout routine slash schedule while you're in boarding school okay so basically almost every single morning i've been going to the gym at like six in the morning because the time that i need to like start getting ready for school is at 6 50 so i have 50 minutes that i'm able to go to the gym in and then i also do school clubs so I do like the running club volleyball so I'm also staying active then and if I don't go to the gym in the morning I will also go in the afternoon because there is a gym in the boarding house so I just use that and I also love going on runs because it's so nice running in Switzerland and there's so many different trails which I've been trying to do. Did you decide on your roommate or did the school choose randomly? So the school does choose but you kind of have a bit of say in it. I didn't really have much say because I was new but they knew that I knew Audrey who is my roommate now so they put me with her because I knew her but yeah they had full choice when I joined they could have put me with anyone and then I think next time you like have a little say like you can ask who you want to be in a room with but ultimately they decide why did you go to boarding school in Switzerland so the main reason for me was like the outdoors like the skiing sports and everything I wasn't really doing as much in Dubai and it just kind of got like a bit boring and I've always really wanted to go to school here and just try it and experience it so yeah that's kind of why and it was my choice because a lot of people asked me like if my parents 
parents decided or it was my choice but it was completely my choice what time does class start and finish lessons start at 8 15 so that's when you have to be in a lesson and lessons end at 4 10 sometimes i have like an extra lesson after school and then it will go till five something i think i don't know on the weekends you're kind of allowed to do your own thing they usually plan activities like today we are going up to Sion to do some shopping and stuff so that will be fun and the school will organize that so they usually have an activity every weekend and then on sunday you can kind of just chill how many people are in your year at school so the school is still super small there is i think like 40 people in my year but yeah i like that it's small it's really really nice so for your devices so all your laptops phones everything you have to hand them in at 9 40 every night even on the weekends it doesn't go later and then you just get them in the morning there's like a tech room i really do not mind handing in my devices because at that time i'm already so tired sometimes i even have my tech in earlier because i just want to sleep so it's really not that bad and they come and say good night to you at 10 15 but you don't really have to go to bed at that time they just kind of say good night and then you should start like getting ready to bed and start going to bed do you do ib here or normal gcse's so i'm finishing my gcse's this year and then next year i start ib in year 12 it's grade 11 are you allowed into the boys side of the boarding house so you are allowed into the boys like the ground floor so where their kitchen is their tv room you're allowed there you're just not allowed into the rooms and same for the boys they can't come into the girls rooms also the school is taught in english it's an international school but people are from loads of different places and speak all different languages i feel so like out of place only speaking english because everyone's like fluent in like so many languages it's actually really cool i wish i could speak more languages but i am learning french at school <laughs> also someone was asking me what this like black bracelet is yeah it looks a bit weird but it is to get into my room so everybody has these as like a key for your room also if you want to see a full room tour i have made one on my youtube so yeah just go watch that video if you want to see an in-depth room tour someone asked is it easy to make friends i would say it's easy if you are confident and just get involved with everything if you put in the effort to make friends it's easy because you're always with the same people so it's hard not to get to know them i feel like it took me even like a couple days to get to know everyone and be like friends with everyone and it not be awkward like now it's not awkward with anyone are you gonna decorate your room hopefully i can put some like polaroids up on that board and stuff because it looks a bit plain i don't know right now i have not decorated my room really okay those are literally like all the questions i could get if you guys have any more comment them down below and i'll try my best to respond but i think that is everything answered obviously i'm still learning new things about the school every day but i hope you enjoyed this video i hope this helped and yeah thanks so much for watching subscribe down below for all the boarding school content coming soon okay bye guys